honestly, I think removing it, while it may soft, it may make t Kyler Murray more likely to see every dollar of that contract because he would have been in default of his contract if he did not complete his independent study. I think removing it only adds another log on the fire to this story. And we can talk about the claws until the cows come home, whatever the expression is. But at the end of the day, the Cardinals have to find out whether Kyler Murray has what it takes to go from good to great. And some of that is not achieved just by God-given ability. It's achieved by being a workhorse that is unparalleled on your own roster, that rivals the other great quarterbacks around the league. The Russell Wilson, who's a crazy worker, Tom Brady and Peyton Manning and Patrick Mahomes and all these guys that have shown that they may have some talent, but talent always carries you so far. And that's what Kyler has to demonstrate. And if he does that, they're going to win a lot of games, and we won't talk about this contract clause. But for him to expect us to say, like, oh, cool, I totally get it, man. You definitely work hard. When your own team asks you to study for four hours a week, to me, he has totally misread what public perception should or would be. Mike, you worked in the front office for a long time in the National Football League. What's your perspective on this back and forth? Yeah, I was really surprised by Kyle Murray being so surprised. He has to understand that there's going to be massive blowback. His agent should have prepared him. From a Cardinal aspect, I actually understand. They think they have a franchise quarterback. They have to work on some areas of development. I understand what they were trying to do. I think there were probably more effective ways of doing it, like having him meet with ownership, come on in, let's all get on the same page. And if there's pushback, Dave, they could have done nothing. He was under contract for two more years. So there's ways you could work on someone's weaknesses and incentivize what you're looking for without going that far as putting it into the contract. So while I understand the intent of the parties, it was just poorly executed. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN Plus right now.